So, getting from Scotland's west coast to Scotland's east coast. So you can join the Forth and Clyde Canal in any of these towns or villages between Bowling and the Falkirk Wheel. So once you reach the Falkirk Wheel, you climb up onto the Union Canal and then it's basically a straight run right into Edinburgh. So when you get into Edinburgh, it's pretty much the end of the canal path. Look out for this bridge. It's called the Fountain Bridge. And note in the distance you can see a no entry sign. That's the way you will be heading. So when you pass through the no entry sign, you'll be on Leamington Road. Just take the time to get off the bike and walk the length of the road. It's not very far, it's about a hundred metres. It will do your legs the world of good. So when you get to the end of Leamington Road you want to turn left onto Gilmore Place and head right along Gilmore Place until you come to the traffic lights. You'll see the King's Theatre right in front of you. So just cross the road and keep the King's Theatre to your right and you'll go up the side of the King's Theatre and you'll be on Travit Street. So when you get to the end, look to your right and you'll see Braham Place and you'll see the park, that is the Meadows. So when you enter the Meadows, Keep the buildings to your left hand side and just stay on the bike path all the way straight. Always keeping the buildings to the left hand side. You'll finally come to a set a toilet a toilet block and then you'll exit the park. When you exit the park, look up to your left hand side and you'll see a sign that says North Meadow Walk. So as you can see the, in the map, you exit at North Meadow Walk. You want to turn left along Buckloo Street for a short distance until you get to Gifford, or Gifford Park. So look out for Gifford Park. So head along Gifford Park and right ahead of you, when you cross the main road, there should be Rankler Street. A Rankler Street. So carry along Rankler Street until you reach St. Leonard Street. So when you reach St. Leonard Street, turn right and head along the road a, p a bit you'll see St. Leonard Street Car Park and you'll see Parkside Street. Now from there, it's signposted uh, to Musselburgh and the coast. So you can either follow the, the cycle path all the way to Musselburgh or you can cut off and head for Portobello and then head to Musselburgh. So that's my easy directions to get from Scotland's west coast through to Scotland's east coast without any hassles. So I hope that helped for your next trip to the sunny east coast of Scotland.